People in Waikiki are used to the congestion there. Now the city has a new plan to make it easier for some, but possibly harder for others. It is a new lane just for buses and deliveries. Our Benga Terra shows us where it's going and why some residents are skeptical. Starting next week, the city is going to begin work on changing the right lane of Kuhio Avenue all the way here from Kapahulu into a transit lane only. It'll take about a month to make the change in the westbound direction from Kapahulu to Launiu Street. You know, people might say, why that corridor? And I, just for the very reason people think that it is a very busy corridor, that's exactly why we want to do it. The city's Transportation Services Department says during rush hour, only 44% of people traveling on Kuhio Avenue are in a passenger vehicle. The rest are walking, biking, or riding either a city bus or a private bus carrier or tour bus. In both directions, we're riding a bus more than once a minute during the peaks, right? And we, at that point, without any kind of um, priority, without any kind of lanes, the bus will be getting in the way of ourselves. The transit lane will be similar to one that opened in 2020 in the right lane of King Street through Chinatown and downtown. Our ongoing study has proven out that we've actually Im improved travel times on the bus by about 20 to 30 percent. The city says private tour bus companies and delivery trucks will also be able to use the Kuhio transit lane, but that will leave all remaining vehicles with just one lane. I think no. I mean, it's already congested most times, so I think that'll make it more congested. I'm all about, you know, the people and public transportation, and I love my holo card, but I do, I do think it's already very congested on this street, so I, it might make it a little bit more difficult for people trying to drive around. And Kuhio gets a lot more congested when Kalakaua Avenue is closed. Over this year alone, the city is allowing companies and nonprofits to close the main drag about 30 times. Currently, the state that Waikiki's in is hard to get in, hard to get out, especially if they have those festivals every weekend. That's, you know, that's going to be adding on to that transit lane, cutting out a lane of traffic going this way and that way. But the city is confident and claims the plan is reversible and changeable. It's something that is a very effective addition if it works as we planned, but we can make pretty easy changes if something goes not according to, to plan or not according to our expectations. City officials are also thinking about putting in an eastbound transit lane, but there's no timeline for that. In Waikiki, Ben Gutierrez, Hawaii News Now.